Hello, my name is Michelle Venegas and I'm an educator at the Natural History Museum of Los Angeles County. Los Angeles is an iconic city that's represented by a lot of different things. Think about the things that remind you of LA. Maybe you think about Hollywood or palm trees and beaches. Or maybe you think about freeways, commuting, and traffic, and smog. Of all the things that remind us of Los Angeles, there's no doubt that the automobile is right up there on the list. This city has a deep history rooted in automobiles, and if you trace it back far enough, you'll actually find yourself 20 million years in the past. Confused? Let me explain. Welcome to the topic of today's video, a history of hydrocarbons. Now when I talk about hydrocarbons, what I'm talking about is crude oil. Think about the places that come to your mind when you think about where oil comes from. Most people think about the Middle East, some people think about Texas, but not a lot of people think about California. In fact, in 1930, California was producing about 25% of the world's oil output. And as of 2017, it was the fourth largest oil producing state in the United States. Now you can find oil throughout the state of California, but the Los Angeles Basin specifically is the most productive oil field in the world by area and it's also the largest urban oil field in the world. You need specific geologic conditions in order to create oil. And about 20 million years ago off the coast of California, those conditions began to form. Let's take a look at this video made by geologist Dr. Tanya Atwater. 20 million years ago, two massive tectonic plates, the North American plate and the Pacific plate, collided for the first time and the San Andreas Fault was born. The fault is the boundary that separates these two plates, and along it, the plates slide past each other. When that movement began, a small chunk of the North American plate got caught, and it was rotated outward over the course of about 15 million years. When that happened, a huge ocean basin opened up, and in that basin, trillions and trillions of microscopic algae lived, died, and became buried in sediment. As movement along the fault continued, that organic-rich sediment got compressed under immense pressure, cooking the organic material into oil and gas, and trapping it under what would eventually become the Los Angeles Basin. In fact, it's the same oil that tens of thousands of years ago found its way up to the surface along a fault and trapped and preserved the remains of millions of Ice Age creatures. The first oil well in Los Angeles was drilled in 1892 by Mr. Edward Doheny. Now in the museum's Becoming Los Angeles exhibit, we have an oil pump jack on display that's similar to the kind that were used in Los Angeles in the 1920s. And although today they might look a little different, you can still find oil pump jacks and oil derricks throughout LA County in places like Long Beach, Montebello, Culver City, and even Beverly Hills. The discovery of oil in Los Angeles in the early 20th century provided incredible opportunities for the city to grow, from the real estate market to the film industry. But arguably the largest impact that the discovery of oil had on Los Angeles was the creation of the automotive industry. Next to the oil pump jack in the Becoming Los Angeles exhibit is one of the first automobiles to be manufactured on the West Coast. It's called the Tourist, and it was first manufactured in 1902 by the Los Angeles-based auto vehicle company. In 1904, there were only about 1,600 motor vehicles on the road, but as the population of the city grew, by 1915, there were over 55,000 motor vehicles on the road. And so began Los Angeles' obsession with the automobile, literally fueled by the oil deposits underfoot. The story of oil in Los Angeles shows us how fundamentally connected our cultural histories are to the natural world, and how the geology of Los Angeles helped shape the city into what it is today. Thank you so much for joining me, and we hope that you continue to join us this month as we celebrate and explore the rich history of Los Angeles. Thank you.